Hi, today I want to discuss with you how I approach planning of a surgery. Now, we will be discussing about male body contouring today. And I'll be showing you how I plan and what we achieve during the surgery. I'll be showing you a picture here and you will see that this man has man boobs, gynecomastias, a lot of fat on the side of the chest, abdomen, upper abdomen, lower abdomen, flanks, as well as lower back. So let me tell you and show you how I plan and how I think that what contour this man can have. And I'll also show you at the end of this video on how the result looks like. So keep watching this video till the end because I'm sure you will love the transformation this man gets. Hi, I'm Dr. Dukta, I'm a board trainer, plastic surgeon working in Delhi and I'm known for more than 2000 body degree procedures which we do. We get patients from all across the globe and today I'm discussing about body contouring surgery in men and my approach in planning that surgery for every individual. So if you see, this is the patient which we have got. Now, once I see this body, I realize that he has a lot of man boobs, big man boobs. On the side of the chest, this needs to be contoured. My aim of doing gynecomastia is, as you all know, I don't like to give any scar for the chest. So I do the surgery from a very tiny, small scar of three to four millimeters on the side of the chest, so that there is no scar on the front of the chest. This is very important because you know nobody should have a stigma after the surgery, which is visible that they have had a gynecomastia surgery in the past. Imagine yourself coming out of a swimming pool or a beach holiday and someone is staring at your chest and you're thinking, oh, whether he knows or she or he or she knows that I've had an animal message in the past. That's not a very comfortable feeling. So that's why I try and do this procedure without any stigma attached, even after doing it. Now, once we have planned this, let's talk about that what we can do for his abdomen. Now, if you see his abdomen, is going like an hourglass shape which a woman desired that doesn't look good for a male so what we do is we plan to give him a v-shaped abdomen make sure that we take out all this fat on the sides i'll also take out this fat in the lower abdomen i also intend to take out the fat in the upper abdomen and at the end what I want to achieve in this patient is V shape at the same time give him a six pack ab look. If we can achieve this, I am sure this patient will be on top of the moon. So, what we want to do is correction of gynecomastia, taking care of side of chest, doing a six pack ab contouring for this male taking care of shape of the abdomen, making it a V-shape. So removing all this fat from the lower back as well as side, which is called the love handles. Removing the fat from abdomen in such a manner that, that is six pack abs come out and becomes much more noticeable and giving, giving him a flat masculine chest at the same time. So now let me show you how we achieve this result. So this is his transformation. This is a before and after. If you can see, we could achieve a V-shaped abdomen, we have achieved a six-pack ab look, we have achieved a flat chest, flat masculine chest, the edges of reptile has been created, the central edge or six-pack ab has been created. So this is what we could achieve in such a patient and you can hardly notice any scars. So that's the beauty of the surgery. If you do it properly, scars are hardly noticeable. Let me show you how he looks from the side view. So now if you see him in the side view, this is how he looks. And can you see this tiny whiny scar on the side of the chest? Yes, this is such tiny small scar is visible on the side through which we did the whole of chest surgery. So no scar from the chest, just this tiny scar of 
like two millimeters or smaller which is left as it fades away with time it will be hardly visible to which we get all the solar. So this was my attempt to explain you how I plan my patient when they come to me for contouring, what do I do, what I don't do, what is my concept in shaping a male body and what results I can achieve with this concept. So if you have more questions about body contouring procedures, please write it to us. We'll be there to help you. Uh, I've always believed that spreading knowledge, you can get rid of myths. If you have any more questions, don't hesitate. I'll be there to share my knowledge with all of you. And together we will have a much more knowledgeable world, a much more fit looking and a good looking world. Thank you. Signing off now. Bye bye.